least two people are in the hospital after a Utah National Guard Apache helicopter crashed in a military training field in West Jordan. Yeah, ABC 4's Annika Johns joining us live from a few hundred yards from that crash site this evening. And Annika, what's the latest there? Well, Emily, Courtney, so as you can see behind me here is that AH-64D Apache Longbow helicopter. Now, as you can see, it's just behind me here. And what, what we know is that it went down in a training accident. So the National Guard has told us that both the pilot in the aircraft, both pilots in the aircraft have made it out with some injuries. Both are being treated at a local hospital, at, but are in stable condition. Now, the cause of the crash is currently under investigation, but the National Guard says they were training here on on site when they went down. So as I understand it, part of the training was uh, kind of landing. So they were just hovering um, at, at the time that the incident occurred. And so that would just be right in the local area, um, kind of routine uh, a training mission again. So the National Guard says that this aircraft is a total loss and that their on-scene investigation is ongoing and the aircraft will actually remain here on scene until that on-scene investigation is completed. So they say it will probably be here for a few more weeks. So it will just be out here in the field as they complete that investigation. Now this is a developing story, so we'll be keeping you updated both on air and online at abc4.com as we continue to learn more. Reporting live from West Jordan, Annika Johns, ABC4 News.